Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim. Yes, that's right. When we last left off, we fought a dragon and we beat the dragon. Where's Lydia? Lydia, where are you? Oh great, you're behind me. Don't do that. There's a witch's place right here. It's got kinds of awful things, the heads of goats and I think that's a spriggan head. Wow, that's something. Right. Let's investigate this witch's crazy house. What's in the barrel? Lavender. What's in this barrel? Carrots. Lavender and carrots. What's under here? Aha! Destruction has increased. Brilliant. Oh, I tell you what. We'll take that book. Thanks very much. What is that? We'll take these feathers. They seem to be worth at least a little bit. Lots of moose skulls and things. It's this black circle. I don't, don't know. Human skull. More feathers. You know, Lydia, I don't really fancy sleeping in this place. And what are these up here? Don't know. Seems creepy. Lydia, I think we've had enough of this witch house. There's more feathers. We'll take them. Right. Let's just check our map. Are we on track? No, we're not. <laughs> we're massively sidetracking. We need to be going southeast and we're heading sort of north. We need to keep on track, Lydia, because uh, we'll never get to Riften. I think we'll avoid them mammoths, if at all possible. I don't know if they go aggressive unless you become aggressive. Oh dear, we have to go sort of through the mammoths. Got a quick save right now because I don't really fancy dying to the mammoths. No, no, I don't. So just one witch, and she really didn't do very well. We stabbed her in the chest, and that was it. That was the end of her. Oh uh, crap! I think we've come across giants here. Yeah, there's a giant there. Right. I'll tell you what we need to do, actually. We need to level up. Look to the heavens! Um, do we want a rank? I think we need a rank in health, to be honest. Um, and... Right, we get to put a, a skill somewhere. Backstab. What level do you need? 30. Right, we don't have that. Why is 40? Muffled movement requires 30. Okay, a lot, all of these, a lot of these are requiring 30. Right. Uh, One-handed. Dual Fury, Dual Weeding Attacks, requires level 30, lots of 30. So I think... What archery ones do we need? I'll tell you what we'll do, I think we'll put another one in... In Destruction, I've decided. Another one in Destruction. Apart from we can't. And that requires 20 
All right, we'll we'll do dual destruction casting. Okay. That's just great. Right. Okay. Not that we ever really duel, so maybe I just wasted them. Maybe it'll give us a reason to duel. Come on, Lydia, we're gonna run around this camp, avoid the giants. Don't really want to have to deal with giants. Right, I'm going to dual wheel destruction to see how it goes. That wolf just ran off. Hmm, what's going on here? Are you friend or foe, sir? Sir? Don't go setting the place on fire, okay? <laughs> no problem, sir. What have you got for sir? Food, what can you buy from Oh, he hasn't got very much to sell, really, though. A whole bunch of stuff we kind of want to keep. No problem. See you later, sir. Until next time. Until next time, my friend. Let's see what dual-wielding destruction actually looks like, shall we? Right, and together? Ah, it's like that, is it? I see. Right. So we've avoided some uh, giants. That's good. I do not... Look, if them guys one-shotted us, then... The last time we met met up with them, then that's a big problem, and I don't think that being at level seven is going to actually make any difference to that. I see a dragon symbol. Hello, wolves! I'm gonna burn you alive. Burst burning everything alive. Wait, anything else? No, just running away. Lydia, you can deal with him. I'm going to strip these of their fur. <laughs> Can I equip? I don't want to equip it. I just want to take it. Hmm, what's these steps? Oh, you've come back, have you? Thanks, Lydia. That was a very slow reaction on my behalf there. It's a, it's a wolf. Um. Oh yes, use fire spell. All right. That's enough of the dual wielding. I don't actually like it that much. What are these things here? This is what I like about being out in the in the wild, although it is a bit scary because you don't know if you're going to come across something dangerous, and unhealthy. A dwarven storeroom, Lydia. Do you see this? I think we should quick save before we go in. Actually, before we go in, maybe we'll just have a little investigation. Are these Dwemer ruins? They're not, are they? Yes! Dwemer Ruins! I had heard about Dwemer Ruins in this game. That's a dwarven ruin. Yeah, I know. Oh, this is so exciting! Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, brilliant! Oh, yeah! Lydia, this is brilliant! Oh, I'm liking this a lot. Right, I think we'll check out the storeroom first. I wonder if we'll find any steam centurions or something like that. Huh? Oh, this is, place is amazing. This place
place is amazing. I, I love all things. I like. Ah, oh, brilliant. This is brilliant. This is just wonderful. All the Dwemer gear is really, really heavy, though. That's, that's the problem. Take that. We need a house or something. Dwemer pan. They're worth something. I need this an expert lock. Ah. ah. Yeah, oh, come on. <laughs> Straight up. Right, ever so slightly to the no, right. Ever so slightly to the Right. There we go. Oh my word! We've stumbled across a massive pile of dwarven metal ingots. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. Yes! What's in this chest? Yeah, we'll take that. What's in this chest? Now uh, we'll take that. Oh, wow. Oh, yes. We're in the money. We'll take that too. Ha ha ha. We're grave robbing. Well, it's not quite a grave, though, is it, Lydia? What have we got up here? Dwarven bits and pieces. A dwarven lever. A dwemer clog. I will take that anyway. Oh, this is, <laughs> this is brilliant. Right. I think this is actually a good place to save. It's an, another expert door. I don't think we'll be able to handle that. We'll, we'll attempt it though when we come back. But until then, guys, let's have a little save. Until next time, uh, still safe. Take care of yourself, and goodbye.